Hey everybody, it's Sheena and happy Monday. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that button down below and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you're notified when I upload future videos. And if you are returning, thank you so much for supporting me. It is Monday, so it's time for another Mask Monday. And this is the final Peter Thomas Roth mask. This is the pumpkin enzyme mask. Now I'm really hoping that this smells like pumpkin spice, like a pumpkin spice latte, or like the pumpkin spice you get for baking, or I'm probably gonna be really upset about it. Um, <laughs> I really want it to smell good. So, after this I do have a bunch of other masks planned. Um, I showed a whole box of masks. I can't wait to start trying those other ones. Like this has been really fun, but uh, I'm ready to try more sheet masks in different brands. I have a ton of Sue AE products and I have some other stuff that I've kind of collected. I want to give away on Instagram, so I have a bunch of masks from that. And yeah, I can't wait. So for the Pumpkin Enzyme mask, it's Apply a thin layer to clean skin, so I cleanse with CeraVe, and then I use the Pixi Glow Tonic Toner. Gently massage in a circular motion with wet fingertips to activate micro-polishing aluminum oxide crystals. Leave on for three to seven minutes, depending on skin sensitivity, so three minutes for me. Um, and let AHAs and enzymes work. Rinse with warm water. Sunburn alert, it can, this product contains an alpha hydroxy acid that may increase your skin sensitivity to the sun and particularly the possibility of sunburn. Use a sunscreen, wear protective clothing, and limit sun exposure while using this product and for a week afterwards. Well, okay. I'm really not happy about that. Like I tend to shy away from products that have like AHAs in them um, just because one, my skin is so sensitive and two, the fact that it gives you photosensitivity on your skin. So for the sake of this video, I will try it. Um, I might get a chemical burn. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up for my face. If all goes well, maybe I won't get a chemical burn, but if we're going based off of what usually happens to my skin, the history of my skin, um, generally these are a no-go for me. I'm just going to go wet my fingertips, I guess, and then get started. Okay, so here's the container and I'm going to smell it. It smells like the pumpkin bread that I make. I make a really mean pumpkin bread. If you want me to give you that recipe, let me know in the comments. It makes two loaves and I just use canned pumpkin because I don't have time to cook regular pumpkin, plus it's not available all year round. Um, this smells really freaking delicious, so I'm honestly, truly praying that it does not hurt my skin. It really does smell good, it smells delicious, okay. So let's see. Looks like the poop emoji. All right. So we massage it on. My face smells like pumpkin pie. Um, and now I really want to eat some pumpkin and I don't have any canned pumpkin, so rude. I don't even care. I don't care if liking pumpkin makes me some basic bitch, then I guess that's who I am as a person because it's so yummy. I know some people hate it, but I love it. All right. I think I've got a good layer going on here massage it in maybe I should have skipped the top lip okay so now we're going to wait for three minutes and uh, let's hope nothing happens to my skin because I smell like a snack <laughs> what do you do when you wait for masks I'm just gonna play with my kids' Nerf guns. Ooh, ooh, my cheeks are burning and my upper lip is burning. Do I leave it? Do I leave it? 
Okay, since my face is burning, I'm gonna take this off. Oh. Oh no. Fire burning, fire burning on the dance floor. Look at my poor skin, look at it. Oh. Oh boy. My forehead's okay. And I'm gonna go give it a rinse. We be burning, not concerning what nobody wanna say. Okay, <laughs> um, oh boy, it smells so flipping good. I am really upset right now. Um, I have a little bit of a chemical burn right here, as I predicted. Um, I'm still feeling burning on my top lip. Um, my ros rosacea just kind of seems, oh, cat hair. My rosacea seems a little more red. Um, my forehead is fine. So this, I wouldn't leave on for three minutes if you had sensitive skin. Um, maybe if you just did a scrub and then rinsed it off immediately. I think that that would be okay, which I might even try, but probably not because I don't like that um, it makes your skin have kind of photosensitivity, though I do use a moisturizer that has an SPF in it every single day, and generally I wear BB cream, so I got that kind of double SPF happening. Um, I'm a little disappointed, to be honest. I didn't realize that this was the alpha hydroxy acid mask or I might not have hyped myself up so much. I didn't really look at it if we're being honest. Um, it says three in one intensive skin resurfacer mask exfoliates with pumpkin enzyme, peels with alpha hydroxy acid, polishes with aluminum oxide, reveals smoother, younger, and radiant and revitalized skin. So if you're not a sensitive skin, it's still all red. If you're not super sensitive like me, I'm going to go slap some, uh, maybe I'll break off that aloe plant. I have an aloe plant. I like plants, but I'm going to take care of them because I can't keep them alive, but maybe I'll just take some fresh aloe and just goop it on there. Or maybe some witch hazel. I just have like straight up witch hazel and I find that's really good for burns. So my face still kind of feels hot at this point. Um, it smells so good. Like it literally smells like pumpkin pie. So that's a plus, but it is not for sensitive skin like it is not 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 for sensitive skin if you have sensitive skin honestly get rid of it so that's everything for today i will see y'all on wednesday thank you so so much for watching if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit that button down below and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're notified when i upload future videos you can follow me on twitter tumblr instagram facebook and snapchat I'll put all of that info in the box down below. I'll also link the playlist to all of the other Peter Ma Peter Thomas Roth masks that I have done. It was a set of six. One, two, three, four. I can't count. Yeah, a set of six. We're done. Have a happy Monday. Bye.